In this video, I'm going to talk about all the AI tools which are helping me to make money and saving me tons of time. So before any delay, let's get started. So the first tool which I'm using, and this is completely free, is ChatGPT. I am sure you all know what ChatGPT is. And the way I use this is to manage the customer services, write the email, write the marketing material. I'm going to give you a couple of examples as well and write the product descriptions most importantly as well. So when I see something, so for example, I am here on eBay, let's say I am also selling this item right here, but my one happened to be brown, it's not black, but I don't want to type all the description, the description right here. So all I'm going to do just simply copy this one right here and copy and come back to chat GPT. And I will just simply type right the product description but my wallet color is brown so chat gpt will know that if somewhere in the listing it say black then it will replace that with a brown so i'm just gonna do that and as soon as i press the enter then the chat gpt will just simply write the new description for this one so um, i don't have any like a copyright problem all that kind of stuff as well because chat gpt is just taking an inspiration from the current description right here which I copied and I am just simply rewriting my own description and if we want to use a proper SEO we can give another command please write with proper SEO so this way we are making sure that our product will get featured on a Google our product will get featured in a search result all that kind of stuff as well so anytime when I need to write the product description nowadays I just simply just you know copy the product description which is similar looking and I just rewrite that inside the chat GPT. The second way I'm using chat GPT is just simply to reply my customer inquiries in a professional way. Like I'm not a native English speaker. As you can see, sometime when I type in English, I make a spelling mistakes, grammar mistakes, all that kind of stuff as well. So when I get the message on Amazon or when I get the message on eBay, I simply copy that message and I will put that into chat GPT. So let me see. Let me show you how I do that. So when I open chat GPT, I just simply will type, you know, when I come right here, I will say customer sent me message saying, then I will just simply copy the message which customer sent it to me. Then I will just put some dot, 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 like I'm trying to like ask something else to chat GPT. And then I will say, please r reply saying, you don't need to put like I apologize chat GPT most likely gonna do that already please wait another two to three days and the courier will deliver it you don't need to worry about grammar spelling just put like a random words inside and uh, courier will deliver it and i am pretending to be customer services guy name zen so i will just simply type that as soon as i press enter then the chat gpt will actually type all the message for me you you will see like this will look really really professional so it type dear valued customer i hope this message find you well i understand your concern please you see as i told you it will put the the apologies all that kind of stuff as well and then it is saying that it will take another two days and then it will type all you know customer services sounding your satisfaction is our top priority all that kind of stuff as well and at the end it even that did warm regard zen customer services team like this is the way you can manage your customer services your email all that kind of stuff as well the other way i use chat gpt is to take the product inspiration it's just simply a, you know matter of you giving a prompt like give me top 10 drop shipping products then chat gpt will give you the products or you know write an email marketing template for this new product launch and i want to send that email to the customer as well so the option over inside the chat gpt are simply limitless the second ai tool which i'm using to make money and save tons of time out of it is called mid journey and this been really really game changing for me as well i use mid journey for designing the product pictures and it helped me a lot i 
use Mid Journey for my YouTube thumbnails. I use Mid Journey for social media posts. I use Mid Journey for email marketing, all that kind of stuff as well. So today I had to make a listing for the product, which is a screen protector. So I just simply came on a Mid Journey. I give a command iPhone showcasing a screen protector. So I have this image right here, which is like, you know, not subject to any kind of copyright, all that kind of stuff as well. And this is a really, really professional looking picture. It given me all these four pictures, but since I wanted to showcase the screen protector, I wanted to copy this picture right here. I can put this picture inside the Canva and then I can, you know, add the product here on the side if I need to add some text, all that kind of stuff as well. But I have something to work with. I have a baseline image. Then the other one for, for, for the case, which I wanted to like kind of get the inspiration for the design. I have these cases right here and then tons of other stuff that you can do inside the mid journey. So let's say you want to start your print and demand business. You want to use, a, you, you know, you want to sell the t-shirt design. You want to sell, uh, you know, mugs, all that kind of stuff as well. So all you have to do is just simply come inside the mid journey and then you can, let's say you want to design a mug with the, with the heart on it. So we will say design a coffee mug with heart on it. So mid journey, as soon as you're going to give that command, then the mid journey obviously going to design something which we can use for print and demand as well. So there are tons of things which I use inside the mid journey. As you can see, I use tons of it. Like really, it helped me massively. It saves me tons of time. I don't have to hire someone to take the pictures professionally. Like simply look at this, like how professional this picture is right here. I before once I needed to do some type of picture. I had to design all the set, take the picture, then edit the picture. This one is saves me tons of time. And then you can see the print and demand one right here. Like, look how beautiful are these design right here. So I can send it to simply, you know, print and demand. I can list these one on Etsy. I can list these one on eBay. I can use a lot of print and demand services. So with this one, it saves me tons of time once I am using mid journey. So the next AI tool, which I'm using for planning for time management for also you know replying to the customers all that kind of stuff is called notion the way i use notion it might be different from like many people use it so first of all i use it for my faqs a lot of time like for example we done this one right here on to uh, chat gpt right here so the next time when the customer will send me a similar message asking me that where is my product all that kind of stuff as well so i don't need to type or give a command to chat GPT to type the message from all over again. So what I do, I just simply save these types of messages inside the notion. So I have tons of FAQ right here. You can see right here on the side as well, like tons of other things which I save. But when I need to save it, I will just simply click on new and I will say uh, customer is saying, where is my item? So when the customer next time will say, where is my item or they haven't received the item, I can simply click here and then I can paste the response from chat GPT right here. And then all of this one, I can just simply copy and I can send it to the next like next person. The reason I said AI because Notion can now also type these types of messages without having to use chat GPT. So what you can simply do just simply click on ask AI right here. And then you just click on improve writing. Let's say you write something you want to make it shorter, make it longer. You want to summarize it. There are tons of stuff that you can do inside the notion. You want to make a social media post, all of that kind of stuff like this, this types of messages, I can even write from the scratch in notion. And this is absolutely free. This doesn't cost you anything. And all on the top of that, I have my sales CRM inside, like for the YouTube, I have my videos idea inside for my property investing. I have like all the property portfolio, all that kind of stuff inside as well. My brain, personal home stuff, all the stuff. I use for Notion and this is really helping me organize each and everything all at one place. So the next tool which I use for my product research, for my product management, to find the suppliers, all that kind of stuff within my e-commerce business is called Zeek Analytics. So the way I use Zeek Analytics, first of all, you can look at the what are the upcoming events are. So for example, inside the Zeek Analytics, there is a calendar on the side right here. So if 
if I click right here, then the next coming event is going to be the Halloween. So about the Halloween, it, it is telling me 46 days until Halloween. But also on, on, the, on the side right here, it is telling me what kind of products that I can sell for Halloween, what kind of keywords people search for. This one right here. So string light, Disney costumes, scary face mask. Then if I need to, let's say, you know, find more details of this specific item, find the supplier, I can just simply click it right here. On the top of that, it will tell me what are the products which are trending right now, what are the niches, what are the keywords which are trending right now. So when I need to do my product research, I can simply look into these. But also, not just that, it is also telling me the product. So if I choose the supplier, so for example, in this case, let's say I want to do Amazon to eBay dropshipping. So all of these products right here have a higher price on um, eBay and lower price on Amazon, but I can also change the supplier. So let's say I want to use AliExpress as a supplier, or let's say I don't want to do drop shipping. I want to buy the products in bulk. Then I can just simply click on wholesale. Then it will compare the prices with Alibaba. So it, it is showing me all the products which have a higher price on eBay. And then let's say I open up this product right here, this one right here on the top. And then it will tell me, okay, well, I can see the listing. I can see uh, the seller right here. And if I need to do the, the more research, I can just simply click on the Alibaba link right here. And then it will find me the supplier on the Alibaba as well. There are tons of other stuff that I use Zeek Analytics to really optimize my listing. For example, the title builder right here on the side, they also use many AI features so I can optimize my listing. I can optimize my title, all that kind of stuff as well. So for example, if I type air fryer right here, then it will show me all the trending keywords which I can use inside my title. So for example, fryer, doer, digital, basket, oven, timer, double free, all that words are doing really, really well. The ninja one right here, because this is a brand, so it highlighted not to really use this word right here. So if I am, let's say, planning to list air fryer or any of that other stuff, this is not just like, this is not just looking for a search volume. The reason Zeek Analytics different because it's also looking for a sales at the same time because it is comparing the real-time data on the eBay. So Zeek Analytics is really great. I'm going to put the link for that inside the description as well. The next tool which I use for drop shipping for many other automation like auto ordering, auto listing, auto stock management, auto pricing adjustment, all that kind of stuff is called AutoDS. So inside the AutoDS, if I move my myself this way, right? here you can see if you need to find the products to drop ship for example so you can just simply use their marketplace and you can just simply like you know pick up the price range you can pick up the pro uh, products from united kingdom so let's say i want to drop ship in united kingdom this one have a really faster delivery time also on the top of that the reason i included this one in the ai tool because the auto ds also have the title optimization feature inside so let's say i want to list this item I, I was looking at this item other day to drop ship from ebay uh from from amazon to ebay i can just simply click on this item right here and then i can just simply optimize my title with the ai zeke analytics uh sorry auto ds have these types of features inside as well and then i can top up my wallet so auto ds wallet right here you can see this one just simply click on balance and you can click on load right here and you can add the balance inside the auto ds so all the suppliers that auto ds support if you get the order from those suppliers then auto ds can automatically process the order for you so there are tons of automations that you can set inside the auto ds as well this is a really really good drop shipping tool and also have tons of ai features inside as well so i'm going to put the link for that inside the description along with a full video how to use it so make sure you check this video right here